Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Derek Lawson's Level Up Travel. You know I love to talk about points, miles, rewards, rewards, credit cards, credit cards in general. Love to talk about cashback. Love to talk about the programs like the hotel programs, like the airline programs, like the credit card programs, like American Express membership rewards points, like city thank you points, like Capital One miles, like Chase Ultimate Rewards. And of course, I love to talk about my US Bank Altitude Reserve points as well. I love to talk about travel. So today I wanna to talk about an upgrade offer I got from American Express. Uh, and it is on my Bonvoy card. So my bon Marriott Bonvoy card is the former SBG card. Um, if you had the SBG card, they automatically moved you into this card. It really is the same as the other card. You do, the great things about this card really is that you, it's for $95 on your fee, you get a 35,000 point free night, easily worth about 250. I think it's worth at minimum like 175 and probably maximum somewhere around like 450, 450, 500 dollars if you get like total sweet spot on the uh, on the redemption of the 35,000 points free night. So they offered me the Marriott Bevy, and I'm not gonna really get into totally like um, this is not like a review of the card, but it is about whether if you got this, look for your in your email to see if you got this if you have that former SPG card because. Uh, there are some nice benefits about uh, getting a upgrade offer opposed to applying for a new card to get a bonus. So yeah, they give me a 100,000 point bonus for spending $4,000 over six months, a good long time. Um, and it is a $250 annual fee. Here's the difference between the cards. Um, and I don't think this is a long-term solution. This is just really, I'm just gonna go for that bonus. I am gonna wait to the new year because it expires at, uh, the offer expires January 11th. I'm gonna wait to the new year so I can get uh, my spend in 2023. And I'll go and get into that a little bit. Uh, but uh, yeah, you have six, uh, six months to get that bonus, right? That's the most, basic, most important part. Both of these cards get 6X at Marriott Hotels. The difference on this card is you get 4X on restaurants worldwide uh, and you and delivery services and you get 4x on groceries. So that's pretty great um, And then you get two and they both get 2x on every other purchase this card This is a kind of a cool thing that might make up a little bit especially if you stay at a lot of Marriott hotels a thousand points per stay not to be confused with per night It's a thousand per stay a three night stay is 1,000 points one night stay thousand points seven night stay thousand bonus bonus points okay so you just uh just keep in mind what a stay the difference between a stay and a night is you automatically get elite status compared to silver status that you got with this not a big deal i have titanium status now and i should be able to get platinum status for next year um now the difference here in the the free night 35,000 point free night that you automatically get with the 95 dollars annual fee the the bevy the new card here you get fifty thousand points after you spend fifteen thousand dollars a year that's why one of the reasons why i want to wait to the 2023 because if i don't go for any other bonuses i might just go for that fifty thousand point free night by spending fifty thousand dollars it won't be too hard uh spending that much money because of the 4x on restaurants and 4x at grocery stores right i might have a decent chance of you know, uh, a reason to actually spend it anyway, besides the 50,000 point free night, you should get some nice bonus points for that, getting four X. So, um, and if I don't get there, like say if I get sidetracked by a bonus, at least I'm getting four X, you know, um, of power up points. Um, so another uh, equal uh, benefit of these cards, you get 15 Elite Night credits. Um, and I just want to let you know what that is, okay? So cause a lot of people don't know what that is. Uh, elite night credits is, it, it gives you 15 free nights that made it look like you stayed actually at the hotel. So if you need 50,000 point, uh, 50,000, uh, 50 nights, sorry, 50 nights to stay at a Marriott brand hotels to get platinum status, now you only need to stay 35 actually in the bed, okay? That is what those are. If you actually have, and here's another bonus, uh, Bonus little uh, tidbit of information. If you have the American Express Business Bonvoy card, which I do, you get an additional 15. It's the only card that actually combines those 15, because a lot of cards get 15 free um, Elite Night credits. This one and the, the, the Bevy does, and the, uh, I think now the Brilliant card gets 25. But the, if you get like combination of both, they will not combine unless you have 
the business card that can combine with a personal American Express card and get you th or a um, or, or one from uh, the Chase one and get you 30 nights or if you had the brilliant it would be um, 40 you start at 40 um, it would just makes it easier to get to those status uh, 50 you know 50 night stays with platinum uh, like for me since I get 30 elite night credits I only need to stay in the bed 20 nights per year which is pretty reasonable for me especially with my work uh, having to travel a little bit and stay in hotels um, so those are the kind of like the comparisons they give and, and I agree that's a, that is a comparison now there's still a $250 annual fee right and uh, $250 annual fee and you do not get an automatic free night I do not think this is even if they give you 4x on those categories those great categories I still don't think it's a long time crowd I would love to downgrade after one year after I do it back down to uh, my regular Marat Bonvoy card. I think it's still available for downgrades. I don't know if it's usually a phone call to downgrade. Um, I don't know if they're going to let me do it or if they're going to discontinue this now. Eventually, I think they're going to discontinue even be able to downgrade, but they haven't yet. Um, so other benefits I think that are important is that there's no credit chart to upgrade, right? In fact, you can still use this card when you upgrade, you don't have to wait for it to come in the mail. You just start using it. Uh, and again, no credit check. So no hard pull, no uh, thing that affects your uh, Chase 524, things like that. Uh, and yeah, that's that's really it. So this is this is bonus hunting right here for me, okay? It's an easy bonus to get. 4,000 over six months is not a lot of money. Uh, considering it's over six months, right? Uh, those bonus categories, I gotta, I gotta eat, so I gotta have to spend at those categories anyway. I think I'll easily, uh, naturally, just if I use this card at grocery stores and uh, and dining out, I'm gonna hit the, uh, the 4,000 in six months, no brainer. Uh, $250 annual fee, yeah, that's, uh, that, that'll be, I'll pay it the first time. I'll pay it the first time. If I'm not able to downgrade, I'll probably just get rid of this card in the second year, because I don't think it's a good long-term card. Uh, especially if you're a person in the game like I am, and a lot of you are, where you have many different cards for many different categories, okay? And you're constantly bonus hunting. So you, the great part about this card is that it's a sock drawer and it has some great benefits to having it. This card, if you sock draw it, I think you're just getting burned badly with the $250 annual fee. There's no, there's no like priority pass that goes with it. There's no automatic free night. You'd spend fifteen thousand dollars again, you know, to get that free night. Uh, if you commit to this card, if you're like a couple card person, or if you're committing to Marriott Bonvoy, then it might be something to keep. For me, that's not the case. So I'm bonus hunting here. All right, and I'm gonna do it in the new year. Check your emails to see if you got an upgrade for this, or maybe the brilliant um, card. Um, Love love the Marriott program. Love, love the, the how many hotels they have worldwide. Love the fact that you can transfer uh, to airline miles at an actual decent rate. Sixty thousand Marriott points you can convert into twenty thousand airline miles, and then you get a five thousand bonus, so it really gets you twenty five thousand. Uh, they have cut some uh, airlines like American Airlines. They've cut a few others. But uh, like Delta and uh, I think Life Miles, which are great programs to have, but they did cut those. But there's so many programs that you can transfer over to that are still really good. Um, I think I'm definitely going to do this. I think you should too, just if you're a bonus hunter like myself. Anyway, that is a video. Uh, let me know if you guys think I should do it. If you guys have got this email to upgrade, uh, if you have the SBG card or another card to upgrade with American Express. Um, and any comments or questions, I love to hear comments and questions in the down below. Uh, but anyway, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notification. So every time I come out with a new video, you'll be the first to know. Have a great rest of the day, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.